Hello and have a good day to everyone. My name is Abraham. Abraham. Welcome to my English to Ifugao tutorial. For today's lesson, we're gonna learn English to Ifugao questions with when. So let's get started. So we have here when in Ifugao, an una. When is an una di? And for the contraction, which is when's, an unai. Alright, so let's say, okay, follow after me. An una, an una di, and an unai. Okay. Question number one. When's your birthday? In Ifugao, an una di birthday. An una di birthday. In speaking, we say it as an unai. So an una di, let's contract it to make it an unai. So let's say it an unai. An unai birthday. An unai birthday. An unai birthday. Okay, repeat after me. An unai birthday. An unai birthday. An unai birthday. That's great. Question number two. When were you born? If you an una di ni anakam. An una di ni anakam. Alright, let's contract it again. An una di, let's say, an unai. An unai ni anakam. In speaking, an unai ni anakam. Okay. You can also use an una di, but in speaking, we, we usually use an unai. An unai ni anakam. Repeat after me. An unai ni anakam. An unai ni anakam. An unai ni anakam. Yeah. And third question. When do you wake up? An una di bumanguna. 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 So, uh, we normally use what time do you usually wake up? So, how to say, what time do you usually wake up? Ngane oras, or ngane oras di bumbumangunam? Ngane oras di bumbumangunam? One more time. Ngane oras di bumbumangunam? It means, what time do you usually wake up? So let's add what time do you usually sleep? In Ifugao, ngane oras ka an mahmahuyo? Ngane oras ka an mahmahuyo? Ngane oras ka an mahmahuyo? Alright. Ngane oras ka an mahmahuyo? Repeat after me. Ngane oras kan mahmahuyo? Ngane oras kan mahmahuyo? Ngane oras kan mahmahuyo? That's great. It, it literally means, what time do you usually sleep? Question number four. When is... This, that, it. This, 
means kitue. That, hinae. It, hibie. So how to say, when is this? Or when's this? In Ifugao, we say, tan una hi due. So, in speaking, okay, we contract kan una hi into kan una. So, let's say, kan una tue. Kan una tue. Repeat after me. Kan una tue. Kan una tue. Kan una tue. Next, when is that? Or when is that? Can you say that for me? Or can you make a if we go sentence using when's that? That's right. An una nae. An una nae. An una nae. That's great. And the next one. When is it? How to say when is it? An una die. An una die. An una die. An una die. That's great. So, question number five. When are you free? Or, when is your free time? So, we say that as. Kan unay free time mo? Kan unay free time mo? So we also use the English one, which is free time. Uh, these days, uh, many people or yeah, many people usually use uh, free time, the English one. So let's use it. Kan unay free time mo? Kan unay free time mo? Question number six. When do you arrive here? When do you arrive here? Kan una di dumatongam itu? Kan una di dumatongam itu? Let's contract. In speaking, Kan unay dumatungang ito? Kan unay dumatungang ito? Repeat after me. Kan unay dumatungang ito? Kan unay dumatungang ito? Kan unay dumatungang ito? That's great. Question number seven. When did you arrive here? When did you arrive here? So it's for the past. You're asking for the past. So we say, Kan una di dumatongam hitu? Kan una di dumatongam hitu? Okay, let's contract. Kan una Dimat ngam hitu? Kan unai dimat ngam hitu? Kan unai dimat ngam hitu? Alright. We also say Kan unai in Maria hitu? Or Kan unai in Maria? Kan unai in Maria? So you can choose which one you are comfortable with. Okay. Or which one you are comfortable to use. <laughs> Alright, and question number eight. When will you come? How to say when will you come? 
An una di umalia. An una di umalia. In speaking, an una. Let's contract an una di to an una. An una umalia. An una umalia. Repeat after me. An una umalia. An una umalia. An una umalia. It means when will we come? Question number nine. How to say when do you go home? We say it as an una di kagawidam. An una di kagawidam. An una di kagawidam. Can you contract that for me? How to say it in speaking? Or, yeah, contraction. That's right. Let's change an una di to an unai. It's easier. An unai kagawidam. An unai kagawidam. An unai kagawidam. Repeat after me. An unai kagawidam. An unai kagawidam. An unai kagawidam. That's great. Question. When did you go home? How to say, when did you go home? We say, an una di nagawidam. We use na, nagawidam. An una di nagawidam. Okay? Let's contract an una di. Let's say, an una. An una kagawidam. Ah, sorry. An una nagawidam. Alright, let's say it again. An una nagawidam. An una nagawidam. An una nagawidam. Or you can also say, An una an nagawid. An una an nagawid. An una kan nagawid. Alright. So you can choose whatever you want. You can use an unay nagawidam or an una kan nagawid. And 11. When does the movie start? How to say it? An una an mirugi. Nan pabuya. An una an mirugi nan pabuya. So you can contract an una an into an unan. An unan. An unan mirugi nan pabuya. Okay. An unan mirugi nan pabuya. An unan mirugi nan pabuya. That's great. And question 12. How to say, when does the movie finish? When does the movie finish? So we say, An una an marpas nan pabuya. An una an marpas nan pabuya. Alright. So in speaking, an unan. An unan marpas nan pabuya. Let's say it again. Repeat after me. An unan marpas nan pabuya. An unan marpas nan pabuya. An unan marpas nan pabuya. And the final question. When did you make that? Or, when did you make that? An una di 
nang ipodam tinae an una di nang ipodam tinae so let's contract an una di into an unai let's say an unai nang ipodam tinae repeat after me an unai nang ipodam tinae Kan unay nang ipodam kinae? Kan unay nang ipodam kinae? It means, when did you make that? That's all for today. And if you have some comments or suggestions, let me know on the comment section below. And uh, of course, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more updates. You can also check the part one of this video. Have a great day and see you in my next lesson.